Hello everybody, this is Sarah Perry and welcome to my channel. I hope you all had a wonderful Christmas yesterday and that you marked it on your future calendar as something memorable and maybe you would like to revisit at another time or something that you will talk about for years. Thank you for all tuning in today. If you'd like a private reading, go down to the website, www.sarahperry.me. There's still 50% off all readings. And if you feel the need to do so, please like, share and subscribe. Now, there are some big shifts today. I feel like there's been conversations yesterday. There may have been a couple of arguments here and there um, and that some things were sorted out. I feel like things might have been ironed out and cleared up as well. Um, there could have been some misunderstanding somewhere and this is all linked to Mercury going retrograde where it's already the energy is coming in where people aren't maybe hearing properly or they're not they're getting mixed up you know things aren't things are getting muddled um free yourself from any annoyances um this is still holiday time and you can still extend your stay of rest if if you're able to you know so i would just stay away from anything that is kind of irritating <laughs> if you can or annoying you know loud music kind of dramas that kind of thing um this would be a great day to um explore what you might be wanting to do in 2023 um i feel like travel could be on the cards for some people or considering maybe you're traveling back from christmas maybe you're deciding to go somewhere for new years um you don't need as much protection as you think you have right um so that's going to make sense for somebody um, I feel like maybe you're questioning whether you go because of all the changes, you know, visas, all this kind of stuff you've got to have. Um, maybe you're still worried about, um, you know, diseases, pan pandemics, everything like that. Um, go back and review everything again because things have changed. Spirit's saying not everything is what you think. Um, I mean, regarding travel myself, when I went back to England a couple of weeks ago, um, I was kind of felt like I was missing a bag or missing a pair of knickers or something because suddenly there was no paperwork when i've last went there was like these reams like a file of facts of of information and printed out copies and test results and everything um and then this time it was just like get on go on the only thing they cared about was how much baggage you had you know um because obviously you didn't want to weigh the plane down because where they were empty now they're full again um so you know things have changed and i think it's going to be quite a revelation it's almost like one minute it was there the next minute it's gone now everything's back to business come on we've got to keep things going kind of thing um i do see that there could be more money in the pot to maybe go out for some of you where you hadn't decided and it might be worth a look um i'm kind of getting offers put out there and saying why don't we just spend it on this and it's like oh well you know shouldn't we like hold on and save for like six months time and it's like no go and use it enjoy it now we don't know how long we're going to be around do we and i'm not telling people people to just go and splurge right and just be ridiculous about it that isn't what i'm saying i'm just saying that if you've been given a gift of something which is monetary to use on something special maybe today is the day you know if you feel spontaneous go and do it really look after your well-being though guys some of you might have a bit of a heavy head from yesterday um don't kind of overexert yourself um just be careful of tripping up i'm getting people just tripping over and this isn't actually anything to do with ice <laughs> it's just i mean i do this all the time i'm constantly falling over i had a conversation with my sister where i said i just fall um actually i'm better now but um the last uh, last month or so i was just falling over everywhere but i do believe that's to do with being grounded it's like spirit gang i'm just gonna trip you up to keep you on track because you're not focusing you know there's a reason for everything guys um something might come in which is again something there might be an offer coming an opportunity an invitation that comes in as a bit of surprise and you're sitting there eating the rest of your Christmas dinner or Christmas cake in your slippers and your pyjamas, watching some TV and thinking, great, I'm going to snuggle up all day. And then someone says, hey, come to the party. Or someone says, hey, I've come to visit. And you're like, oh, no, I forgot about this. Or, you know, again, there could be muddled miscommunication going on. Or, you know, oh, it's changed my whole day. I feel it's going to be a blessing and surprise. In, in disguise, not surprise. Um and it will be good for you okay and it's coming in for that very reason there's there's a lot of happiness around today um if you listen to your intuition um but i also see you know some reconnections with people and like somebody could just turn up on your doorstep 
which could end up being a blessing because it's somebody you've been waiting for for ages and you, you thought you had it all planned but actually this is so much better you know yes you've got to get up and get dressed yes you might have to hoover around well actually they won't care about that will they just enjoy the moment it's really really important i do see more focus today um i'm seeing people kind of actually pulling decorations down because they're already fed up with them but that's probably because you put them up too early and that's for the person that put them up on the 28th of november really we hadn't even had guy Fawkes by then um, <laughs> but there is i feel that some there could be an offer here for a house as well or some money to buy a house or something that is come in um unexpectedly okay again it could be a knock on the door when you're just chilling out and it turns out to be a blessing in disguise so do open the door guys don't hide behind it because you could be like brushing away something that is really really wonderful so i hope you have a great day if you'd like a private reading get on down to the website www.sorrowperry.me and enjoy your christmas i'll speak to you soon bye for now